Hi, I'm Jonathan Smith. I'm head of production at TT Games, where I've been lucky enough to work on Lego Pirates of the Caribbean. I'm going to be shown some footage of someone playing the game and talk about it as I see it. There's Elizabeth Swan and Will Turner, pursued by Captain Jack Sparrow. Just some of the many brilliant pirate characters we've got in Lego Pirates of the Caribbean. This scene is from movie one, The Curse of the Black Pearl. This is actually the third level uh, in that movie story sequence. And here we can see a player using the cannons to blast at the interceptor. Boom, and blowing up Lego. The character he's in control of is called Marty. Uh, he has the awesome power of an explosive Lego gun. But here he's picking up the Lego cannon and he's gonna place it and then try and find the hidden Lego elements that he needs to hoist that up to the upper deck. Now the game takes in all four films from the whole saga of Pirates of the Caribbean, going right up to the new movie, Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides. But it's been great fun for us to go right back to the start with Curse of the Black Pearl. And as soon as you hear that music, that great theme starting up, you're reminded of how fun that world is and as we've found to develop the game, what a great place it is to set Lego action, full of these great well-known characters doing cool things, searching now for the secret Lego. Don't forget, in any Lego game, there's always more to discover. Wherever you look, you'll find hidden objects. You'll be building with Lego and then using it in different ways to overcome the puzzles in a surprising way. You've got Marty building the track here, which means that he can now push the hoist on one side to raise half of the cannon, but he'll need to find more Lego elements to do the other side. Climbing up, and in fact, climbing and clambering under the ceilings is actually a new element for Lego Pirates of the Caribbean that we haven't done any of our Lego games before. And nice to see Cotton with his parrot there. Always good to see Lego animals. Okay, so we've hoisted up the cannon. That's going to enable us to go back to the upper deck and uh, really take the fight to the opposing ship. You can hear the rumbles of the cannon fire in the background as we go up and try to free Captain Jack Sparrow from his imprisonment. Now to activate a cannon, you're gonna have to find a torch to light the fuse. So first of all, while the battles rage on the deck, here we picked up the cannon put it into place and then find that torch, prime the fuse, aim the cannon, aim the cannon correctly and with our third shot blast through and free Jack. There's Captain Barbosa. It's been such a great world and story to play in, this world of Pirates of the Caribbean. Full of drama and great characters. 